Hello viewers, we're gonna play some World's End, Chapter 1. We got Ivan here smoking, some Depaco, uh, Isabel bored out of her mind, we got Lord knows what the fuck Vadim is doing right now. Um, and Tevrin? I don't know. Anyways, let's do this. So this level's a little fucking hard, cause imagine like 8 Ivans, fighting 8 Ivans with that spear. Maybe I'm over exaggerating, maybe six. How, ah, how convenient. Seems fortune itself smiles upon our most noble mission. See how your fears were for naught. It's a little too early to say anything like that. That's one hell of a house this guy's got. Alright then, let's get to busting up this hovel and slicing up yonder bugloots real swift. Not so hasty. We must assess the situation carefully. How many are our foes? Might we evade them? These are important aspects of tactics as it happens. I didn't think you'd actually care about strategy. Now that I'd, it'll make any difference, of course. The old man fought in that old war, you know. When he's sober, which ain't often, he actually thinks about that sort of thing. Huh? What's that idiot think he's doing? <laughs> he's grabbing his nuts and just like, fuck you guys. Holy guard boy! Get to sniffing this skeetly bag of beans I has upon you. Dig that? How, you! How'd you get in? Stop right there. God, what a fucking moron. I should have known something like this was gonna happen. We're not screwed yet. Can't we just use this as a distraction and sneak past them? It may be prudent. See you then how hiring that boy was already served has already served us well. What a fine decoy he's made. Let us proceed. Yeah, have at us then, scrub. I wait to bring in the whole crew here with his backup. Tevrin and company, his name is. They ride over yonder. Misbegotten spawn of a genderless gutter trollop. I should have disemboweled him when I had the chance. Don't say I never told you so. Alert! Truders have breached the premises. All of you, drop your weapons and surrender at once, or prepare to die. What audacity! I'll make no such absurd preparations. Here comes that violence you wanted so badly. So, Alright, so these guys are fucking rough. When I first played this, I died a few times. Not as much as the last little fight but a pretty good amount um they don't have as much like they have about the same amount of health as the thugs but the only difference is they can hit two people at a time so never put them together another thing i want to say is that um um yeah good luck with that like jeez they got 85 percent hit rate or hit chance so eh, pretty good chance so of course, if you lower, if you use smoke attack, it would go down by 50%. So yeah, so it would go down to 45%. What's weird? Okay, so what's weird about this uh, in in this game, in this one, if I remember correctly, they do 50% as like in, instead of 80, it will be 40. Not an actual 50% where like it'll go down by uh, from 80 to 30. It'll, it'll be 40. So, uh, I think in later games they fix that. So yeah. But for evade to keep it as uh, as you actually get a 25%, which is good. I think it should be like that, honestly. Um, so you can move them all up here, on, like as far as they can go. Uh, yeah. I am gonna make Tevin run away though for a good while because he needs to tank some hits for us. Just a little bit, not not too much. That's for the dim. We're gonna go check this well out and get uh, pilfered the well. Received these gloves, fifty Zoltex. So these gloves and ch increases hit chance. Uh, these guys don't have um, dodge chance, just for magic attack. And I know it's called special, but I'm gonna call it magic. Um, so yeah, so for Isabel, it's always gonna be. Uh, 90% I think we should give it to Ivan personally because his hit chance is 85% I don't like to use a knuckles I tried it it's okay in part one and part two eh, pretty uh, it falls behind uh, or I mean triple fist yeah I don't like to use triple fist because it's okay in part in chapter one in chapter two it falls behind between the early to mid game and then when you finally get like a really powerful um, knuckle equipment you can't even equip it till chapter 
3. And then at chapter 3, it's not bad. But the hit chance is low. Um, Alright, so we'll give him the Thieves' Gloves. Uh, we can't hit anyone. So we should be good here. They won't be able to hit us. Like, they, they, they just can't reach us. If they had one more step, they could have hit Ivan. But no. Or Vidim, too. Yeah, I think Vidim, too. Okay. So I'm gonna wait for a back attack because with the double stab. So I'm gonna wait. Uh, for her, I'm gonna probably hit this guy. 28 damage. All right. Okay, and then we will we'll hit this guy with spear plus. All right, so he's still alive. That's not good. Uh, I'll just get him to finish him off here. All right, great. All right, let's move him over here. Uh, all right, we should be good. Now I'm gonna get a few hits on Tevrin, but that's okay. Tevrin's got a lot of health, and Ivan's pretty decent on the health. The ones we should be worried about is mostly Isabel because fucking Vadim's got good dodge chance, honestly. Wait, is our dodge chance good? Let me see. Oh, 10%, that's okay. Not the worst. Yeah, zero. Isabel, what you got, girl? 10%? Yeah. I know Tevrin's got zero because he's fucking slow. Yeah, there you go. Uh, yeah, that motherfucker ain't ever gonna be dodging that well. Alright, spear plus. I'll hit him again with the spear. And then I'll hit with a flame bow. I do set up one roll for myself for this game. And just one, if I'm gonna be shopping, right? Honestly, I, honestly, I always only upgrade my skill points so we reach a checkpoint. Uh, you don't have to, you can upgrade it anytime you want, but you just can't forget the skill. Only when you're at a checkpoint is when you can do that. All right, we're gonna mockery them. Uh, I'm gonna go over here and double stab this guy. 43 damage, look at that. It's, like, it can go up to 43. Pretty good, I have to say. All right, they're all gonna hit him. You could have, I could have just kept him far away, even further away, but it's fine. We should be able to kill him like perfectly well. Nice dodge, but not needed. Uh, let's do this and do this, and then uh, hit. Hold on, Vadim, where can you go right now, bro? Alright, you go stab this guy. I know he's gonna get a hit on both of us, but that's fine. I can I can take it. Uh, okay. Bam. And then dead. Perfect. And then we can use that dead corpse to throw something at this guy. Yeah. Oh yeah, it's so good. Alright. And this is why I upgrade offense first. Um... All right, let's have them face forward. So maybe one of them will hopefully dodge. All right, no, none did, but that's okay. At least we tried. Uh, this fucker's dead, honestly. Like, there's no way in fucking hell he's gonna kill one of us. Yeah, look at that. Just, just, just go down. I said go down. I'm not even gonna waste a double stab on you, man. All right, very nice. Now, it's not over yet. I don't think so. Flawless victory plus 10 skill points. Oh, this music so good. Foolish ruffian. Your antiques could have resulted in a most humiliating death. Yeah, true. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, true. Truly that were. But us and ours were living yet, you dig? I shan't be doing any digging whatsoever. Know that in the future, such reckless behavior will be punished without mercy. So what next, fearless leader? Shouldn't we be moving away from here as quickly as possible? Yes, very good. There must be some entrance or another in the vicinity. I do act and do exercise some caution as we proceed. Let's go already. I'm losing interest just standing around here. You'll not be standing for long. Oh my god, y'all look the fucking same. Damnation and hellfire. Tell me I'm not the only one who saw this coming. Oh, right, so this one's a little harder than the other one. Um... Completely optional, 
We could totally use this to ignite this oil. Why there's oil there, I don't know. I really don't. But uh, yeah, it's kind of really hard to get them lined up. I usually push this guy here and then like do it. But I think I'm gonna run away. I prefer to run away from these guys and focus on these. Uh, fuck this guy up. Uh, oh wait. Yeah, I'll move him once here. And now, uh, bam. I'll throw a dead corpse at him, and he's dead. And then we get to throw another corpse because, uh, you know. Okay. Uh. Okay, just bam. And we'll run over here and take on the marksman. And we missed. Nice. I love that. 90% miss. Fucking awesome. Totally not upset about that. Alright, they're gonna get some hits in, but that's fine. Alright, so next turn I'm gonna have Tevrin totally use Mockery. Because uh, they're getting close enough to just bombard us with spears. Oh, and, and fucking Ivan's taking all of it. Jeez. Alright, Mockery. No, oh, what? No, should I use it? No, I'll move first and then use it. Yeah. So this guy can turn and Ivan's uh, hit chance will uh, be good. I actually can get two hits in here. Hold up. All right, great. And then grab and throw so you can turn back and look at Tevrin. Okay, awesome. Then I'll... Do I want to use double stab? Yeah, no, uh, yeah, this will work. All right. That is so good. I don't know who wouldn't use this. Now, my strat for my, my other uh, playthrough is that um, I use I take brag, and I'm gonna be also be using a double stab. Reason being for two abilities is that I'm gonna go for the berate section, like berate set. The berate set comes with one very good uh, ability, and that is scold. Scold increases the uh, magic uh, or SP uh, regeneration rate. Uh, and and how percentages work, right? By 50%. Uh, regeneration increased by 50%. How re how how uh, percentages work is that uh, the more of a raw number you have, the more you'll gain from the percentage. So Tevrin has four. He'll probably only get two uh, regeneration per turn, two extra, and that'll be six. But if he had nine, for example. Instead of just getting two, he'll get like four more, or two more, I mean. So that'll be four extra, ah, uh, how do I say this? If it's nine, he won't only just get two like he did with uh, four. He'll instead, from plus two per turn, he'll go from plus four. Uh, yeah, I'm sorry, I'm fucking not good at explaining crap, apparently. I hope, I hope that was understood, though. Like... I'll give another example while uh, these guys get their turns in. Um, so, uh, so, this certain character has a move that can increase everyone's damage by 10%. So, this spell at 40 will, uh, at 40 attack, will increase her attack stat up by 4 with a 10%. But if she had 50 attack stat, it would go up by from 4 to 5. So yeah, the more rod number, the higher the uh, the higher you gain from the percentages. That was so much more better than the fucking SP one. I think I explained that way more properly. Oh, I'm so sorry. Okay, so let's uh, let's stab this guy. I will throw the corp the corpses at him. I actually can get some hits in on this. Get two people at once. Fucking awesome. Ooh. Yeah, there you go. Fucking awesome. All right, and we still got. Oh, we don't have mockery. All right, we'll hit from the back, and then we'll fight, turn our backs so that they don't go for Ivan. Hell, maybe they'll go for Isabel. Who knows? 
Oh yeah, that went for usable. That's fine. I'll fucking take it. I will fucking take it. Damn. 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 Oh shit. All right. It's fine because we have another mockery. I don't know if y'all know this, but Terrina has the lowest uh, SP regeneration, which is very upsetting. Alright, he's low. I mean, I think this guy's low. So he should be kneeling down after this hit, maybe? Yeah, there we go. Uh, I'll throw a corpse at him. And he's dead. And then I'll move forward because he's trying to try to go for Tevern. So let's run away. You will attack that guy. Alright. Okay, he's turning our backs. He's turning his back against us, so that's great. There we go. I could throw a body to help him out. Alright, here you go, Vadim. Thanks, Bogo. Alright. Uh, let's move away. Wait, could I throw another one over there? Hold up. Oh yeah, I totally can. Oh yeah, this fucker's like dead next turn no matter what. I don't even think I'm gonna have to like move. I think I could reach him with the bodies. Ah, uh, he'll be fine. Yeah, he's fine. Yeah, he, can su he can't survive another hit, but it's okay. Cause he's dead. All right, receive eel extract plus five skill points. You have to be real smart and strategic, cause if you're not, you're just fucking reckless as hell. Like it's like some like Final Fantasy one game, then it's gonna be like fucking brutal for you. You're gonna die hard. Some might think this may have been a mistake. No shit, I'm getting out of here before I get killed. You'll do nothing of the sort. We've come too far to turn back now. Too far? We're still in the damn courtyard. Indeed, and we'll continue on relentlessly, pursuing our most noble goal. I knew I should have prepared a will. Such prudence befits only the feeble and cretinous. Now, let's calmly assess our resources and proceed with temerity into the innards of this matter. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Alright, let's do that, man. Alright, next grand upgrade is fucking uh, Ivan's aggression. Yeah, and then we're gonna upgrade the dims too. For the next set of battles, we're gonna save our skill points from there. Uh, for good reason. Alright, onward we go. Wait, did I check if there was a codex? I'll be right back. No, there is no codex. Alright, let's go. Whoops. Oh my god, he's giving himself drugs. Damn, that motherfucker is on drugs. Those are the eyes of someone on drugs. And why is his lip so dry? Ah, what a rush. You've done well, Dr. Gat. I must say I've rarely had a better fix. We remain amongst my most valuable and highly paid servants. <clears throat> Very good, sir. But know this. My appetites are nearly insatiable and my tolerance ever increasing. Therefore, you must continue to produce the very best medicines. As you wish, sir. Yes, yes, you're secure for now. But fail me even once, and your replacements will be harvesting your delicious glands for future chemical concoctions. Oh dear. I'm trying to sound old, but I'm not doing a good job at that. My lord, my lord, there's an emergency. Your estate has been invaded by murderous rogues. Who would dare trespass on the domain of Boris Belyov? Turvin Lord of the Third Tier. Mobilize the guards and hunt down the interlopers at once. At once, Lord. Ah, with all this excitement, I'll need another blast. Dr. Gapt, your services. Right away, sir. I'm so old. My back. <laughs> what a gaudy and contemptibly shanty we find ourselves in. Its creator truly has no taste in design. You kidding me? I'll take you over where we're living in a heartbeat. Criminals, your continued outrages against Lord Belov, Be Beliov ends here. Turn back at once if you value your lives. You might want to consider turning back yourself. Very well. Your arrogance will earn you a slow and painful death. Okay, they're all high too. Look at those eyes, man. You know, it's always the eyes. It looks like they got pink eyes, but jeez. Um... 
I don't know, this is just coincidence. But uh, later on, there's going to be a country that's going to be brought up. And uh, I kind of noticed a pattern where like... I don't know if it's just me, right? But the ones with yellow eyes come from that country for some reason. Because I don't know, it's just a coincidence. But... Mm, uh, what do I want to do here? Oh, yeah, 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 okay. I want to have a dim over here. Now I'm gonna fucking mock you right away because this fight's kind of, uh, kind of rough, honestly. Uh, but it's not that bad. Now, yes, if, if Mockery's, if Teverin uses Mockery and he's behind someone, they will fucking hit both of them, no matter what. So, yeah. This is kind of confusing because, oh yeah, I'm gonna have to move out of the way, man. That's not good. Who knew it is not good. Like missing that, the missing that one shot was bad. All right, but because he has to move around Ivan, he may not be able to target him. I don't know. Yeah, he can't target him. Great. And now everyone's on our asses, which isn't that good. Um. Who is low? That guy is the lowest. I'll take him out. Alright, he's kneeling. No, he's not kneeling down. Alright. Tough motherfucker, huh? Alright, I'm gonna double stab you. Because why not? Alright, belly off spear. That's great. Alright, so the strat with skull. More SP regeneration means that even if I use brag, which costs 8, I'll still be able to make enough because it lasts two turns and then eventually I'll be able to use brag with double stab eventually after like what four or five turns I don't know it, it takes a while but not being able to get hit is very good uh, I could go for two hits here this guy for some reason has a lower defense so why not okay and then I'll move this guy over here and then throw a barrel at your fucking face. How do you like that? That's right. You don't like that, do you? Huh? Alright, they're probably gonna go for I uh, Vadim, so let's just. Yeah. Yeah, 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 that worked. Oh, now they're gonna go for fucking Ivan. It's always Ivan, honestly. Yeah, ooh, that's not good. Okay, thank god they target someone else. Fucking shit! Oh my god, and my god, all right, hold the fuck up. I'm gonna fucking, yep, I'm gonna do that to you. How do you like them apples? He still doesn't fucking have a, um, okay, hold up. Hold up. If he dies, I'm starting the fight over. Yeah, fuck you, dude. Okay, and then flame bow. Hopefully, they go for Isabel. I'm gonna have her back facing this way. I'm gonna have him stab him. No, but then I'll go for him. Okay. All right, I'm gonna, I'm gonna stab. Come on, I'm gonna stab. Yeah, I'm gonna look away. And you're gonna face forward. Hopefully this all works. All right. Okay, he's still looking that direction. All right, perfect. We're fine. We're we're fine. We're fine. Stasis shot is a problem. So what stasis shot does is you're still and you can't move. You can attack though, which is great. I'm gonna fucking throw daggers at him. Uh, let's keep that distant. Oh, no, it's too far. Let's keep the distance, but fucking hit him with the spear. Alright, yeah, Ivan's gonna be good. He's fine. He can take it. He, 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 he took on those thugs, man. Alright, so I'm gonna use Mockery. To get the fucking um, archers over here. Uh, okay, I'll be between the two bodies. And I'll throw one at fucking the dim. That's fine. 
you dodge, very nice. You could get, um, what's that fucking move called? The one that slices arrows, hold on. You could get a uh, dark cleaver, which will chop arrows out 50% of the time. It's actually a decent um, chance to dodge him out. It actually does feel like 50%. Um, all right, let's do this. 17, 14. Nah, no, I'd rather shoot you, bro. I'll throw, um, yeah, I'll throw this. Very nice. I still can't move, so eat this. And, and let's, ma let's make sure he fucking runs away from Ivan. Because they could totally target Ivan if they get in range. Uh, okay, that's fine. Yeah, we're fine. Tavern has plenty of fucking health. Okay, we can move now. Hit him with a dagger. He's still standing. Alright, now he's dying. The next hit should kill him, but maybe not. How much health he's got? He's got 17. This does... No, it totally won't. No, it won't. Alright, that's fine. Another stasis shot, that's okay. Cause you're fucking dead. Eat a dagger to face. In the face. Five skill points. Victory! Flawless victory. Flawless victory plus ten skill points. Nice. Now, if you get a chapter two and you if you don't import a save from what you played from chapter one, uh, you'll technically get less skill points. Like some stuff will be upgraded, but less you'll you get less skill points, like by 50 or some shit, I think. I'm not sure. Chapter, but then from chapter 2 to 3, you lose more. So it's like, uh... My lord, it's terrible. The invading villains are slaughtering us left and right. They're approaching this very room. Then why are you chattering at me? Go on and dispatch them. I'll give double stimulant rations to every man who takes a head. I'll lay down my life if I must, lord. Ye gods, they're already here. Ah, uh, Dr. Gift must be nearby. Do the byproducts of his narcotic chemistry not tickle your nostrils? Are you sure it ain't the gimp? It doesn't look like he's washed in ages. I bet it's just him you're smelling. Hey, water isn't cheap. I thought you should talk. Haven't you even been wearing the same sweatpants for the last two weeks? Who are you villains and what are you doing here? Our names are not important, though our present business is. You captured my pharmacist and I intend to rescue him from your gnarled clutches. Capture? What nonsense. Dr. Get came to me of his own accord. The pay I offer- Black. The pay I offer him is far beyond what he received dealing with your common ilk. It's- It's true, Mr. Tevin, sir. See, old man? Just like I told you. Too bad we couldn't have passed the point of no return before resolving that. Don't you fool see. The good doctor has been thoroughly brainwashed by this lout. Clearly, we must cut him down if we hope to break their sorcerer's bond. I don't think brainwashing works that way, but since we come this far, this far, this far, hide yourself at once, Dr. Getz. I'll destroy these brutes with my own hands. I've been saving some of your special medicines for a situation like this. Dear heavens, all he wanted a quiet retirement. Worry not, Doctor. Your rescue is imminent. Guards, ex execute these hoodlums at once. Thought you said you'd kill us at your own hands, douchebag. Man, what a fucking wuss. Alright. So, this guy will use mostly range attacks. And if you're close to him, he'll try to run away. But, but, if you, like, block his pathing with these four characters, like, for example, if he was in the middle right here where our party are, he can't move, so he will automatically use a very powerful melee attack. Caught the Butch's Knife. which ha He has 52 attack. He's got the, uh, Boris Noble Garb. It gives decent defense. Yeah, it's a board train that gives him 10% dodge chance. This is an item which allows him to focus. I forget what it does. Pouring opiate increases defense. And then he has enema water, which is basically fucking um, Laszlo's poison knife, except it's with the range, which is worse. And it reduces HP by 15 and not 10 for two turns. As for bathtub moonshine, uh, it, it could get a character drunk and increase. Um, well, he'll throw it as an offensive, so like, 
He'll throw it at us, we'll take damage, and then we'll get...